Hey guys, it's Tick and Tag. Welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. Yeah, this game where we stare at the fabricator for a week. Sometimes. <laughs> Honestly, that's like 90% of the game. It's just true. staring at the fabricator. <laughs> yeah, no, so, yeah. that's not even like a joke or anything. That's... I don't remember what I was going after. I need what? to like write this shit down. You do, Grim. Fuck you. <laughs> Whoa, 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 it's magic. Oh, you know, I don't know this. What? Can... What'd you do? Okay, there we go. I got some... Because I pick at my scabs because I'm a dumbass, right? I freaking got some hairs stuck under it. Under one of my band-aids that I put on. Uh, and it, they were just pulled super tight. So they fucking hurt. Maybe you should, like, rewrap your, your legs. Just so you don't pick at them. Nah. Nah. Oh, what a plebe. You're a plebe. What a fucking plebe. Hey, can you bring me that blue tea? No. And also the blue bucket? No. And also turn the light off? No. Why not? Plebe. Why not? Because you're a plebe. That is not a reason. That's a, that's my reason. Well, you're a dipshit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm going to leave it over here anyways. You think, this, you think this bothers me? You think I'm bothered? No. You disrespect me? You disrespect my family? Vinny, hit him with the sticky hand. <laughs> I fucking love it. That's so stupid. Yeah, that's real silly. I don't remember what I was doing. Fuck! Genuinely no idea. I think I was just exploring, actually. You want me to look it up? Bubba? Bong, finger guns? No, I didn't. I didn't do it. I did. Uh, he didn't respond at all. Alright, so now it's... Episode, this is episode 19, so episode 18. Did Brayden make the offer to you already, Thomas? Yeah. To shit in my hand? No, not that. Vance trying to get a little Yeah, I'm considering. Yeah. I know that I, I know I have to figure out by this weekend, because obviously... Well, by next weekend. Because yeah. I'm sure if you wanted to come over to make your car your character shit at any point, you could do it. Oh, true. So, you're basically till next week on your time. That's true. Yeah, we're getting, since you hang out with us anyways, you know, you could see if you with all of the other, with our coworkers. I, you, it's funny, because Gabe remembers you, for sure. Well, yeah, I, yeah, we talked about it. Do you remember Yeah, I remember And, uh, then there's Anthony, and I think you'll like Anthony. He's alright. Anthony? Yeah, he's alright. No, he's not alright. He's great. He's alright. He's okay. great. That, watching a bit of that didn't help. <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's all you know, up here. Yeah, but it's up all up here, in the brain. Yeah, up here is a scrambled egg. So, <laughs> so it's not working so well. <laughs> yeah, it's one fish, two fish, blood, red fish, you fish, hot dog, rabbit, three, two, four, five. I don't know. <laughs> that sounds about right. It it doesn't make any sense. This is adding up. Yeah, like it. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I gotta go way over into a place. I need two lithium. I need gold. I think I have a bunch of damn gold. gold. Shit. I hope I have a bunch of gold. gold. I don't want to go find yeah. gold. I don't want. I don't want to go find. I don't want to have to go find gold. Hot pocket. Hot pocket. No. The witch is dead. No, which witch is the wicked witch? Ding dong, wicked witch is dead. <laughs> that, that is how I, how I do the thing. <laughs> That's just generally my thought process. <laughs> oh, you know it. He's sipping too hard. To He's trying to suck the soul out of it. Yeah, you know how it goes. I bet he would give excellent sloppy toppy. Oh yeah, totally. I definitely could have gone the rest of my life. You heard him. Free candy? No. You can have some, though. <laughs> See? So it is free. It yeah. definitely wasn't free. <laughs> what do you and mean? I'm willing to... You know what? No, I have none. <laughs> what did it cost me? <laughs> Your soul. Yeah, say everything. <laughs> it's okay. I have this cool frisbee now. <laughs> you want to get you a bucket so you can start just eating it in there? Chuck that? Yeah. Glad we're on the same wavelength. 
What? I don't have a Reese's. There definitely isn't a single Reese's over here right now. Yeah, these are all like the Hershey's. Mm -hmm. Dark chocolate. What did you say? Not like those cup things that break No, those are Reese's. Those are Reese's. These are not. These are Hershey's. Oh, well then they have any Reese's. Okay, well we don't have any Reese's. What? Not over here. We said you that. not listen at all? <laughs> no, he really doesn't. No, I was trying to hear you like explain the differences between the candies that you had. A not, Reese's? Not where the candy was. No, he said he's like, but he also just said earlier, there's no Reese's yeah, over Yeah, I wasn't listening to him at all. It was yeah. just you. And See? Like, it was just all like everything. You're the problem here. Everything yeah. that you said went into my head and I'm processing it and everything that Brayden was saying was just rebounding. <laughs> Bouncing right on. <laughs> You need the parallel mind skill. Maybe it'll help you out. Dude, that'd be awesome. <laughs> Basically just have multiple heads. Oh, gosh. But not heads. Not multiple heads. Multiple minds. But if That's all, why they're called parallel minds. But if they're all thinking about the same thing, then the same thing will happen. It's like the one where it's like, I can compute, like, a thousand things. Uh, at the same time, it's like, does that mean you're smarter? No. I'm, I'm stupid, stupid faster. faster. <laughs> <laughs> it's so dumb. Yes, it is. I'm also going to use this since you took... That fan instead of my fan over there, I'm gonna use that one tonight. The one that's by the table. To do what? For my room. Actually, yours might be better. Okay, well, mine's over there. I know. And that one's already out there. Not for long. I'll fight you. You can fight me all you want, that doesn't make you right. <laughs> bitch. Actually, I've been considering buying a new fan anyways. There's right. something wrong with the one and like the highest. Even though it's on three, it only blows like it's on two. Oh really? Yeah. So it's also on all the time though. So, well, yeah, like, like twenty-four that's, hours a day. Exactly. That's not surprising at all. Mm -hmm. Which is why I'm like, and I was already fighting. like an old ass fan. Like, exactly. Out of the closet. Yeah. See, because of all these factors. Yeah. I'm considering hey guys, just buying a new fan. For it's myself. supposed to rain tomorrow. Wow. I think it's, I don't think it's that expensive though. Cause, uh, Connor got his. For I will like 20, 30 bucks. Yeah. Well, also, I'm probably going to get mine on sale because it's going into winter. True. <laughs> so. You could also, yeah, so, you know. I could also probably find a super cheap one online. I mean, yeah, I'm not above that, that obviously. You could look in the used market, see if anybody's got one in town. Not that you would ever do that. But true. Lead. I'd rather have a new one that'll last me a little longer. You find one. But it's so cheap. I literally just said so that I could get a cheap one off the internet. If you were going to play this, what do you think you would be? Yeah, what class? What do you think you would like? Oh, dude, I don't know. I don't remember all the classes. Bards are so super long. funny. Like so you, you here, just think on of my the type of goal that you like. It's like, what uh, would you want to do just uh, to like, have a good time? I have the player handbook wanna, on there. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> no, I'll probably, well, I'm fine. I'd probably just be a... Uh, I don't know, I like to go simple. I know I went mage the first time that I ever played. It was yeah, a but that was not, that's not simple. Yeah, no, I, I'm yeah, literally no, advising no, I said, That's why that. I said I went that way. Then after that, I've only ever been, like, melee characters. Kind of, people would just kind of, like, just, that are, yeah, they're just, just be a hit, barbarian. Hit with stick. Yeah, yeah basically. That's it was what, simple. That's what we're going to try and convince Anthony to do, is be the barbarian, yeah. the drunk barbarian. <laughs> like I told him, I'll give him, like, damage resistances and damage buffs to all of his attacks and does. everything when he drinks in combat. <laughs> like in he could be a dwarf it would like even fit his character just yeah fat hairy dwarf and, and like that's the thing about uh freaking alcohol is that's uh, the way it works in a lot of games I too think, like, I can think of something that could like kind of fit Thomas what freaking a morally superior monk he's like not the monk that's like been out in the world fighting or like doing any like crazy humanitarian work he's the kind that like studied for a while in just like a really cushy monastery, it was like it was loaded, and then after he went into the world, he was just like, "I just feel better than all of you people. Like, I'm like so well learned and educated. Like, you know, look at you. Like, you're suffering from like famine. I bet you don't even know about crop rotation yet. <laughs> you dumb. Yeah, just be a dick. To you big dumb. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> but you know the bare minimum of fighting skills, so you've been able to defend yourself from all of the like the poor people you stab that out. bitch. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, I've been like three poor people have tried to stab me, but because they're poor people, I easily defeated them with my bare hands. Your bare hands? Yes. You have bare hands. <laughs> I'm 
just trying to think of like what would fit Thomas and like what would allow him to have fun. And the only thing I can really see is any class where he could be morally superior to other people. Whatever. I've had fun before without being like that. Yeah, I don't no. know. One of them I was what a half. I was a half orc. Yeah. And oh God, that was a fun one. I used intimidation to steal it on yeah, the you just entire inti- cart. You just intimidated everybody that you like yeah. came across, and like you used the fact that there was an epidemic. And that there wasn't enough law enforcement to stop you, so you just started taking people's stuff. I took a man's entire livelihood. Oh, well, that's an idea. You could be a bandit, but, like, a bandit that works with us. A bandit? Yeah, you could be a bandit that's, like, I want to, like, have legal accomplices, so, like, I can steal people's stuff, but from the outside, it looks legit because I'm with a bunch of adventurers, and surely they... Like, they didn't steal anything. Like, it's just me. <laughs> but because they work with me, it must mean that, like, I'm a good guy. Yeah. That could be your class. Thomas, you could just be a bandit, and you could just be a bad person. <laughs> but you just roll with us. You're just a bad guy. I don't know what else to tell you. You're just a shitty person. <laughs> you just... You That's it. You just bully everybody you run into with your freaking massive battle axe and your bulging biceps. Oh. You're just a trash human being. I don't know what it is. Yeah. You're just fucking terrible. You make everybody suffer. <laughs> yeah, totally. I could see it. That's fair. That's yeah, fair. I could see it too. Yeah. It's I wonder what that says about Thomas as a person, though. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm excited yeah. to make flesh centipede. So I mean, my my sense of entertainment is going to be from dissecting other creatures and putting them back together in different combinations. And then Thomas likes to intimidate, beat, and steal from people. Yeah, I don't think any of us are good people when it comes to the. Indie. I think the only time I've ever been good was when I played as a paladin, and I was actually forced to be good more than I was... Like, I tried to run away, like, abandon my party when we fought a demi-lich, because it sucked our cleric into a vortex, and so we had no... It we just... It literally just hovered above us, and we had no way to reach it. We couldn't fight the thing. And so I just tried to flee for my whole life, and I was told by the GM, no, you're chaotic good, you have to stay and fight it, so I'm just like... No, you're chaotic good. Yeah, it was... You don't have to stay and fight I think because it was, you're chaotic good. Uh, okay, I think it was lawful good, but Well, even then, like... Okay, the GM was basically like, no, you can't, you can't leave. Like, well, you can't I, just leave your allies, like, behind. <laughs> Based off your character, you're staying. Yeah, you're a good guy, and you have to kill the Deadly Lich. And I'm just like, um, I, I don't know, I try to jump really high to hit it, and I fail. And so basically... <laughs> Like, to give you an idea of how this dungeon was going, because I was so confident, it was like the first time I played D&D, we were going through this freaking maze to get into the dungeon, and like, every couple steps, I would get shot by an arrow, and I didn't even try to dodge them, I was just like, I just walked through, and I just got shot by arrow after arrow after arrow after arrow, and they dealt like, very little damage, but they just built up, and I'm like, okay, I get to the end, and then I just start tearing the arrows out of my body, and so I just start taking more damage, and Eventually, he's like, yeah, okay, just stop. You're gonna, you're gonna die this way. <laughs> and then we had the whole demi fight, and our cleric immediately got sucked into a vortex. And we didn't have a means to kill the... Like, even we, it just floated above us because the ceiling was really high. So we didn't have any ranged weapons or, like, oh, any way to deal with it. So it, it basically just killed us all. What kind of party doesn't have any ranged weapons? I literally built an uber paladin murder hobo tank. That's fine. And it would what about the rest of your party? Um, I don't remember. Look, our cleric was like the guy who was going to be able to deal with this. And he instantly perished. Well, he didn't perish. So he got sad. sucked into the vortex. And if he, if we didn't like kill the lich, he was going to basically stay there until he died. And of course, we all perished. So, yeah, it wasn't super well thought out because my entire thing was specializing in hitting them one time and instantly killing them. And I did a really good job of it's just that I couldn't stab the demi because it could fly. Yeah, and I'm not dead. 12 feet tall, so I couldn't reach it. So, yeah, it was very unfortunate. Yeah, that's how it goes. But this time I have greater aspirations, and I have a lot of flexibility oh. because of how I built my character. Yeah, and, and also, you course. have a really cool DM. Yeah, who's willing to work with me? So, in theory, my flexibility will only increase, and the only thing that can really stop me is if my stuff, like, gets damaged or broken. Like, basically, since all of my scrolls are going to be transmuted onto paper, uh, if the paper gets damaged or destroyed, like, the scrolls won't work. So, the advantage of carrying around a bunch of consumables that 
will give me an incredible amount of flexibility is that it takes time to prep them. Right. I have to specifically grab them in the middle of a fight, and if they get damaged or destroyed, then I lose it in its entirety, along with all the resources. So it just it's a it's a money loss if I can't deploy the spell. Right. But you know, if I get to ambush somebody or something, and I happen to have a fireball spell that I put on a scroll, you know, it's worth it. It works. Let's shoot them with a fireball. Right, right. Right. Gotta get this. What? It's a electric scooter thing. I I see that. That was not the question. Because it's so cool looking. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> it's so cool. With that same energy though, couldn't you just buy a Segway? Probably. Well, but this is only <laughs> I, I, this is only two hundred and fifty bucks. <laughs> Segway would cost me. Get a shitty Segway. <laughs> but this thing just looks so funny. It's got a, a bike tire obviously in front. And that's where the motor is. And then it's got a like a wagon, like a big chunky wagon tire on the back. And it's like, dude, it'd be so it'd be so funny to ride. It says it goes up to like twenty five miles an hour. Which is faster than the scooter I already had. But it's been on it's been for sale for a long time. So it'd be like maybe I can knock him down to two hundred. Maybe. And then I can have this really stupid thing that doesn't make any fucking sense. It happens. And then I could, and then I could just bolt a um, like a chair to it, <laughs> so I could just sit on it, right seated on this thing, depending on how tall it is. And actually, that's like too big. It's thirty-six volts. I'm sort of close to get thirty-six volt. Station Hey, hey, hey. Six volts. Make you better. Let's see. This is what you need. <laughs> That's because it shoots actual, like. Salt. Yeah, shoots actual breath. I mean, I don't doubt that you would have. Oh, well, it also runs off of fucking gas canisters. CO2. Yeah, CO2. Yeah, CO2. But it's high power. I mean, yes, but what I have doesn't require any ammunition. Nope. Or anything. It's just convenient and cool. That's about it. Convenient? Yeah, you just you don't even have to swing around, you just aim and fire it. Yeah, but only when they're not moving. Yeah. yeah. But that's a lot of the time. Like, one of the big issues with trying to kill the flies is that they're not going to hold still for you. But when they do, and you try to kill them, then, you know, they'll get up and they'll fly away. But with this, that kind of, you know, removes that issue of, like, spooking them. You just shoot them. They're like, oh, I'm comfy. I can react in time. Blam! So. Blam! You're done. They just die. Okay. Messing around, Brayden. No. Stop fucking around. Not yet. He's fucking around. I hate you. He's not doing out. what he's supposed to. He's about to find out. Ah. Okay. Here's the structure effect. Six volt, oh, uh, twenty amp hour, one hundred and sixty-three dollars. Good for less than a thousand.
Where's the boy? Mm. Where you smell? Mm. Mm. That's not very good. Mm. That's it. Mm. Yeah, I don't have to explain myself to you. Bitch. <laughs> Can you do me a flavor, sir? What do you want from me? Look up where the architect organs are in some way. Where are the Arca 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 Arcan Arkansas? Where is the Arkansas River? Arkansas <laughs> Architect. Architect, what? Uh, organs. Fuck. Organs. I blame you for that one. Why? I didn't do shit. You were supposed to remember the how it, you know, how it said. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. The architect organs can be found in the crystal caves. Okay. Cool. In fact, you could end up accidentally visiting it since it's just below uh, Mark Ewart Melidia's underwater base. Purple crystals here are a clear giveaway. Once you see these spires at the center of the chamber, just dive deeper to spot architect cash. So what's up, boy? Oh, oh. What is it, boy? Oh. I'm gonna make that splash. Oh, freaking uh, Kingdom Hearts three is part of the uh, like game catalog on PlayStation. Yeah. So I have Kingdom Hearts three as well oh, as nice. one, two, and Birth by Sleep. Hell yeah. And like two point five. <laughs> There's lots of weird shit in the Kingdom Hearts series. True. True. So, we should play Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Do it. Pick it. Make your choice. We'll see how I feel whenever my next choice comes around. What's the next one you're choosing? Little Nightmares 2? Yes, I think so. Called it. Oh my god, he's, done. he's falling to the abyss. Bonk. <laughs> 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 down we go. Down, down. Down, 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 down. Hey, you knock that why, shit off right now. I don't know why I suddenly started whistling the uh, Aladdin song. The Aladdin song. Yeah, I can show you the world. That's what that was. Oh, true. So you do get messenger messages. Wow, the battery dies so fast on this. Like, literally, I unplugged it when I got here today. And it's just been sitting over there, and it's already at 65% battery. That's why it died. Holy shit, I didn't realize the battery was so bad. It just yeah. was off when I went to check it the other night. Yeah. And I'm like, what the heck? It's only been unplugged for like a day. Yeah. It's toast. The only reason it works at all still with the battery is because the case has a battery in it. Yeah. So you have to like activate it to charge the freaking phone the whole time. It's really bad. I know I've 
been to the Crystal Caves before. Once before. I don't remember how I got there. Clearly, as I'm flailing about. What if I go a little further out? Ringer. Oh, that's what it needs. This thing needs the ringer on. So that way, um, that way, uh, if, if it goes off, you'll hear it. Maybe. Maybe. It's not, yeah, it's not very likely that you'll hear it. Because you'll be listening to headphones or some shit. Right. I just want to see how loud it is, but it's not. Can't I turn up the ringer? How do I turn up the ringer? There's no option. So there's that right now. Ringer and alerts. That's it. Just max up. That is as loud as it goes. <laughs> I just want to see what kind of how much noise it makes when you get like a messenger message. Because Shay's going to send it. I want to be. What did you say? I want to test something. Text me. No, we're talking about getting that sweet. Oh, okay. Uh, no, just for fun. But I was like, oh, that's it. That's the that's low as you get. That's sad. Yeah, so it's basically worthless. I think literally my plan was that if I got a message, I would just message you, telling you that he messaged. That'll work too, as long as I'm home. Yeah, true. But I mean, chances are you'll be home, because when they message, it'll probably be like 7 or 8 o'clock at night. Yeah, like they tend to. Yeah. I understand there's a time difference, but also there's something called quality customer service. <laughs> Put this in low power mode. Point. That's an idea. Yeah. Too bad it doesn't matter! This battery's still gonna die really fast. Ouch! What'd you do? I just got duck bubbles. Duck bubbles? I know nobody knows what that means, but don't worry about it. Oh, I'm worried about it. It's also the same thing as chicken skin or goosebumps. Goosebumps is the more widely known one. Making any progress at all? No, I'm looking for this place. Uh, fucking useless. Fuck you. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to find your way through this maze either. If I played it enough, I would. Maybe. This always happens to me too with games like this, where it's like I get really comfortable with a place, right? Yeah. But I get comfortable going to a specific place in the place, <laughs> so I get lost trying to go literally anywhere else. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. That'll do it. It happens a lot, too. I'm ashamed to admit it. Not really, but I am. <laughs> oh. Is 
this the place I'm supposed to go? Is this the place place that I like? <laughs> it kind of feels like it. Does it? I know. Well, we're at our time limit now, Brayden. I know. I can't believe you've done this. I can. <laughs> <laughs> And you had, we had that like little yeah. weird adapter sticking out of it so you could just plug it in yeah. to your actual phone. That was funny. Because it got a little solar panel. Worked okay. I don't want to take that. Hold on. Find a good spot. Cease movement. Nope. Sprish. Alright, where's my dinosaur? Sprish, brash, I was taken. I know we've talked about it before. Isn't that song about that guy not being invited to a party in his own house? Basically, <laughs> he was in his he was no he was in his house, and someone started a party in his house while he was taking a bath. Right. So he was not invited to a party in his own house. Yeah. Basically, a bunch of people broke in. It's so it was so dumb. Alrighty, well. Alright, well, if you enjoyed the video, consider liking and subscribing. Definitely go check out our other channel. Until next time, peace out. Bye-bye.